Welcome, we have an ML model which predicts the range of an electric vehicle under various conditions. So here's is our landing page. Let's start by finding the predicted range of an example EV. These values were taken just as an example from the same dataset which was provided. So here they are. These are the predicted values of the range of an electric vehicle in various conditions as mentioned. Now, let us have a look at how the interface works with the model in the back end. Let us import all the basic libraries. Now it's time to load the data into the notebook. Data.describe gives description of database. Data.corr helps us to find the correlation between our result and the features. Data.nanique counts number of unique values in each category. As we have seen in CORR matrix, the wheelbase correlation is negligible to electric range. Similarly, some other features are not used for prediction. Then check the null values. Let's split X and Y, features and results. Normalization is used to scale multiple features spanning varying degrees of magnitude, range, and units so that it could improve models' performance. Since regression predicts continuous range of values, we need to use evaluation metrics such as mean absolute error, mean squared error. Now let us check the May value. Oh we got a value of 8.955, which is pretty good. Let's explore other possibilities too. Let's put the data in Decision Tree Regressor, which observes features of an object and trains a model in the structure of a tree to predict data in the future to produce meaningful continuous output. This model gave a May of 14.50. Let's check for Random Forest Regressor, which fits multiple decision trees on randomly extracted subsets from the dataset and averages their prediction. This gave a May of 15.52. Let's try for Randomized Search CV. In Randomized Search CV, instead of providing a discrete set of values to explore on each hyperparameter, we provide a statistical distribution or list of hyperparameters, this gave a May of 14.01. Let's try to improve using Grid Search CV, it is a technique for finding the optimal parameter values from a given set of parameters in a grid, it's essentially a cross-validation technique. The model as well as the parameters must be entered. After extracting the best parameter values, predictions are made. Here it gave the best suited parameters, let's assign it to a model. It gave a May of 16.17. Conclusion Out of all these five models linear regression has given the less May hence it is used for our prediction. We have used the Flask library for the web interface, starting with importing of the necessary Python libraries after which follows the statement which reads the pickle file which was created and dumped after the model was trained, later comes the HTML rendering part in which the necessary values from the user are fetched and stored in an array, these values are then normalized and sent to the model for prediction, after the prediction, the predicted values are then sent back to our web page which are displayed in the form of a table.